Hello everyone, I am Murat Öksüzel. Uh, in this video, I will show you how to execute some JDAL commands from a Spring Boot Java application. And let's go over the sample application I generated. And uh, to keep it simple, I this is an ordinary Spring Boot application. There is only one application file. Uh, and in this file, we define a rest controller and to execute some JDAL commands we define the commands as you see here we give the uh, for example we give the JDAL translate command and some sample uh, arguments to convert some TIFF file to a JPEG file uh, we split this command to give to runtime execution. This will run the command in uh, command line and we give us uh, the output and we will print out the outputs to uh, terminal. We will inspect the outputs as you see here. And after that, we will Download the uh, generated file uh, using this output endpoint. We will download using this uh, response entity, as you see here. We will give the output file head and download the result. Well, uh, I am using this sample TIFF file. I just searched the Google for a sample TIFF file. I let's show you and this is the sample file I downloaded from internet we will convert this TIFF file to a JPEG file and how we will do it we will dockerize the application to uh, let's inspect the docker file uh, we are using uh, the OpenJDK 11 for the <laughs> base image. As you see here, we are uh, copying the uh, jar file into our image, the, our sample file, as you see, to uh, just test it. And we will install, we are installing the GNAP command line you think this using these commands run update update install lib jidal install zip jidal data or and jidal bin packages we are installing these packages and at the at the end we run jidal uh, info version command to verify we installed the jidal uh, successfully Let's put this uh, image. First, we will we need to compile and package the application. Yes, our jar file is generated. Let's put our image. To see the output, we are giving the progress clean argument. Yes, here's minus there. So I think some sort of typo. Hello, and yes. <coughs> Our Docker image is generated now.
Yes, we see the GDAL info version output and it seems our GDAL is installed successfully. And let's run this container in 88 port. Yes, our Spring Boot application started. Let's go to the localhost 880. Yes, our mod is executed. The digital output is here. And as we see the output endpoint, let's call this output endpoint. Yes, our output file is downloaded here. This is a huge file. Yes, that's all. Thank you for listening. Good coding.